This is how it all started. I had this girl named Ashley Gordon contact my mom on Facebook saying that she had gone through something similar that I have and instantly I knew I wanted to go see her. Nick Price said, I wanted to go out and meet this girl. Without seeing or speaking with Ashley Gordon. What happened to you? What happened to me? The 17-year-old academic magnet high school senior knew he wanted to show her and show up for her. Like it's very rare for us to see something like that. Nick knew something Ashley was learning, that she was not alone. You see, both had received the devastating diagnosis of brain tumor. There's not many teenagers like us that have gone through similar situations that I have. Nick's diagnosis of exophytic pontine glioma came two years ago. Ashley's brain tumor diagnosis a year later. Phone calls and emails, they developed a long distance friendship and soon the talk turned from diseases to dancing. She, she asked me um, if I wanted to go to Sadie with her. A Sadie Hawkins dance, you know, a dance where the girl asked the guy. She had low expectations not knowing that some random guy from South Carolina was gonna come all the way down to Florida um, just to, for some dance. But he did. Nick drove all the way to Tampa by himself with the help of the Nick Price Foundation. But once he got there, he had to get through Ashley's big brother first. And she thought I was catfishing and you know they had left the house and left their older brother there, just their older brother so that they could see who this random is from South Carolina. The Nick Price Foundation was created to help people who've been diagnosed with cancer through deeds and dollars. So I don't treat them as another person that has been through, like, has, has had cancer. I treat them as family. And that's exactly what he did for Ashley. He rushed to her rescue when she expressed a need, an otherwise perfect stranger. But Nick pushes away any praise. No, I wouldn't really label myself as a hero. He says he remembers what's been done for him. All the different combinations of what you can do to help somebody and just basically make somebody happy. And he is grateful to be alive so he can do the same for others. Sometimes it's just showing up to be there for him.